In this video, we're going to take an editorial approach to the Bridal Party shoot. At the church, you saw we were using the deep umbrellas, and we had very little time, so we wanted that nice, large light source to give us beautiful illumination while we work quickly. We were able to light the entire bridal party and have enough spill light in the environment to give us beautiful quality of light in that situation. Here, I'm going for something less traditional, more editorial. Think of it as a magazine shoot something that's more edgy and fresher and more young for the couple. We have a little bit more time here, so we can involve some a little bit more complicated posing instead of just stand them up, look at me, smile, take the picture, and move on. We're using the Apollo strip light because I want to control that light. I don't want a broad type of light that's lighting the entire environment. We're in a space that has very reflective surface on the floor, white walls, bright windows in the background. So I really want to control that light so we're just illuminating their faces. I chose to use the Apollo strip in a horizontal manner, also using the grid. So again, controlling and shaping that light to just illuminate their faces. So I'm pre-touching this image instead of retouching it. So you get the idea right in camera and your eye goes right to their faces. We found these great chairs in the environment, these kind of throne-like chairs. So here's where we start getting into posing to make it a little bit more modern. We have the bride and groom seated in the chairs in kind of a powerful stance, like they're the king and queen. And we bring the bridal party in, and we break things up. Instead of people just going according to height and all standing looking at each other, we get eclectic with our posing, meaning one of the brides is going to sit on the arm of the chair, a little bit flirty, leaning on the groom. Maybe the best man is on the other side of the bride, and he's given a real stern look, real attitude you know, bending their knee, a little bit off to the side with their posing, having the other couples kind of flirting, and you can actually give them direction. Tell your couples what you want from them. Have fun with this, because this isn't your traditional type of pose. This is more of a fun editorial magazine pose. In keeping with our editorial style shoot of the bridal party, let's go one step further. Normally, our lights are all daylight white balance, and our light would balance between the daylight that's coming in and the light from our flashes or strobes. But we want to keep this a little bit edgy. Think of it as a little bit of a day-to-night technique. So what I've done is I've put correct to orange tungsten gels on my flashes. I've set the white balance in my camera to tungsten white balance. What that does is we get a correct flesh tone on our subjects. All the daylight that's streaming in is now rendered blue, very cool tone, kind of that day to night or a real edgy feel. I'm also going to underexpose the ambience, ambient light within this room to draw you in, to give it that richer, darker feel and to bring out the reflection of the windows because they have this cool archway within the tile floor. So now we have this very edgy, modern, very much editorial style shoot. 